Hello all, my name is Krishna and welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, uh, yesterday I had actually uploaded one video regarding the left skewed distribution and the right skewed distribution. And we also understood the relationship between the mean, median and mode with respect to this kind of distribution. Now why this question was important because it was recently asked to one of my subscriber in an interview itself, right? Now considering this, what I told that I'll be making a list of questions like this. So today I'm going to talk about the second question. I'm just going to give you this particular question. Try it by your side. Try to write down the answer in the comment, right? I'll try to see the answer. And again, whenever I get time, I'll make a detailed video regarding the same. Okay. So the second interview question that was asked recently in a real world interview to one of my subscriber. This was the question guys. So the interviewer said that, okay, if I give you a task in order to like the task is basically to calculate the average size of all the sharks in the seas. Okay. So what is the steps? What are the different, different steps that you're going to take? You know, you just tell us the detailed steps one by one. You can basically write down the comment in the comment section of this specific video. Okay. And remember guys, this is a statistical questions, right? So you need to think that if I really want to find out the average size of all the shark in the sea, how should I proceed with? Okay, you can you can definitely uh, you can also tell us the confidence interval probably what is the minimum to maximum value within that specific range the shark size may be and again guys there are various ways to do it you can take any steps that you basically want okay but you really need to tell me this specific answer and remember when you are commenting down make sure probably you you tell us in at least three to four points because at least it will take three to four points what are the exact steps that you are basically going to take. Okay, so I hope you like this particular question and just try it out. And again, I'll make a detailed video regarding this. Again, guys, this is a tricky question. It is not uh, a very easy one. It is a tricky one. And people who know at least some amount of statistics will definitely be able to answer it. So yes, I'll see you all in the next video. Have a great day ahead. Thank you one and all. Bye-bye.